Hi. Okay, so I'm going to answer a question. I got a question, and this is kind of a touchy subject about periods. Periods. Yeah. Um, I'm going to answer some questions that I thought of when I first got it. And, um, like, um, a question that someone sent in to me. So, I'm going to be answering questions. So one of the first questions I had was, what should I do? Well, it's kind of hard to explain. Um, what I did while I was at school, I'd say I got it when I was at a swimming field trip, and it was like five minutes to the end of the thing, so, you know, I didn't really have that much to worry about. But luckily when my friends had some protection with her, and she was nice enough to let me borrow one. So, just ask a friend or something. And if they don't have anything and you're like at school or something, don't try to use toilet paper because it really does not work. Like, it doesn't. Seriously. I tried it. It doesn't work. Um, if you have to, tell your teacher because your teacher can, like, help you. And... I know it might be kind of hard if you have a guy teacher, but if your teacher's a man or something, then just, like, say your secretary at your school is a woman, just go tell her, or just tell any woman teacher there, I think, if you're not comfortable speaking to a man about it. So, yeah, just tell someone and they'll help you. So, also, um, what, like, someone asked me this, um, what was your first reaction to it? So that's a question about me. But, um, my first reaction was, oh my god, what am I going to do? Because I was like, swimming, right? And I went, to the, I went to the washroom and I had to go pee and there I was. So, my first reaction was, oh my god, what should I do? <laughs> and so, yeah, that's my first reaction. So, how to use a tampon? I don't use tampons, so I don't know. Um, there's, oh my gosh, I just got another one. How, how do you use a pap? Okay, I, I'm going to make another video, like, tomorrow, or possibly tonight. Um, uh, it's like 9.01, and my grandma's be yelling at me soon, and she says she wants me to go to bed at like 9, I don't want to go to bed till 10. Um, I used to go to bed till like 11. But, yeah. I go on YouTube every day, just so you guys know, so you guys should, like, if you have any questions or anything, just message me, or you want to just talk to me, message me, and I do have Skype, and I have Hotmail, so if you guys message me, I will send you that. I have Skype, Hotmail, Twitter, and all that stuff. I don't have Facebook anymore. I do have a Facebook account, but if you add me, I won't add you, because I don't use it anymore. Like, it's nothing personal, I just don't use it. So, yeah. Well, not really it, but yeah. Um, so, another question I had was, how should I tell my parents? Well, how I told, well, I live with my grandma, so people know. I live with my grandma part time, and my other family part time. So I just like, I just went out there, I'm like, Grandma talked to me, and she's like, yes. And I'm like, I got protected. And she's like, do you have protection? And I'm like, yes, I do. Like, okay. And so she's like, okay, I'll get you more. So she called my aunt, and my aunt got me some pads. Kotex. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. Another question I had was, should I tell my friends? It's really up to you. Like, it depends who's in your circle of friends. Like, are they really supportive and nice to you? Or are they are they going to laugh at you? Like, you can judge that. Like, if you know them for long enough, you'll know if they're going to laugh at you and judge you or something, or if they're going to be supportive. I did tell my friends. Um, so, I did not hold back to tell my friends. Um... Well, of course, it's to happen to school set to hear about it, but if they didn't hear about it at that time, I did tell afterwards that I got it. Um, 
another thing is like uh you may not want to tell your teacher at first but like it happens at school and you don't have a phone or anything to call your parents or something or you don't like have a friend that has anything then um then you just need to like tell her like it's not like your teacher's gonna yell at you like i'm still in elementary school i'm grade six um i'm almost seven i'll skate that maybe <laughs> okay so anyways i am not really on a very good base with my teacher my teacher hates me but anyways yeah you just you need to tell them because like they can help you um like they can like get you a pad or like that I know they don't keep tampons at the school, but I know they keep pads. Because I have gotten the school ones before, like after that. And I didn't have anything, and neither did my classmates. So I went to the office. I got it today, actually. Anyways, yeah. So, yeah, you just need to tell someone if it happens in a place where it's not really. Um, my friend asked me, she's like grade 4, she's like, well, what if you get it, like, at a store or something? If you're at a store with your mom or something, you need to tell her, because the store might have, like, pads there, you know, it might be, like, near a store that has pads, so your mom can go get them for you, or something like that, so you need to tell her. Or, like, what if you're with, like, your dad or something? You either need to go get them by yourself, or you just have to flat out tell them. Like, you can't, like, hide it or anything. Um, yeah. Because pretty soon they will find out. You can't hide it. So, yeah. I hope that was helpful. If you have any more questions, just message me. Or comment me. So, yeah. Okay, thank you for watching. And fuck with your period. It's going to be a bad video coming up. I'm not sure why. So, bye guys.